as far as therapy, therapy and trauma, so how does this... Well, we don't practice it as a therapy uh, because you have to be licensed and, and so what, that's where we're unique. We're offering, uh, you, some people can say, well, it's a, it's a healing therapy. Uh, it's not. We're creating a space for them to heal themselves. Um, one of the recommendations that, that we do is, is if somebody has a, an emotional reaction and a big trauma release that we weren't aware of, we support them to get fully present again. But in getting fully present to themselves, we, uh, the recommendation that I always make is, is that here's, here's some therapists that you might want to talk to. They're going to understand what you're going through. And the question is this, how many times do you have to re-traumatize yourself before you're ready to let go of it? And they think about it, and, and I said, so if you're ready to let go of it, this would be a good time. Now, some people release trauma right on the table and without any emotional reaction, but others don't. And so when that happens, they're, they're always the recommendation is to get them therapeutic support, and, and we give them uh, support to get to, get to that. Um, because we're non-invasive, we're not doing unto anybody. We've not had what you would say meltdowns. Uh, of trauma, trauma release in the sense that, that it created problems. But that's also why uh, some therapies, some modalities believe in cathartic releases. They work and run energy to force a release. But see, that's a do unto. We do with. We don't do unto anybody. I don't believe you have the right to do anything because my belief is, and a lot of people disagree with it, but I, I want to clarify something. The do with, it basically says, we believe you have the power to heal yourself if you can get fully present. The do unto is through the modern medical model. And so it's not saying that you shouldn't use modern medicine or that you shouldn't use therapy. It is very complementary to what we do. And we're not a replacement to it. We're an enhancement to it. By being more present, you're more effective. That shows up in more recent writings for medical doctors. They found out if they don't have any bedside manners or they're not relational or they have no social skills, they may be the most brilliant uh, surgeon or whatever else, but not very good as a human being. And people's healing and trust in them goes down. So it's still about presence. And so what we're saying is, is how do you get more present to yourself to the people so that they can work with you, not us do unto them. Uh, the hardest part the first week is people unlearning, I have to do something. You don't have to do anything. All you gotta do is be present. And uh, as you well know, uh, that is difficult, very difficult. But then when you get it, it's suddenly like, oh my goodness. And then you realize there's this energy and this capacity just to be present with them that changes their lives.